Hey Maniacs, it's Genia and Gaia. Hello girl. Back here. Yes, thanks for joining From us today. Yeah, well, this is my room after all. <laughs> that's true, that's true. So thank you for joining me today. Yeah, no worries. Your camera and your no audience. worries. So today we're going to be trying out vegan snacks. From Tesco, which is literally our favorite place on earth. All of these things are accidentally vegan. You can find it in every single Tesco. Without further ado, let's eat because I just had three crumpets and I'm on a roll. <laughs> so if you guys are ready, let's get this video started. Savory or sweet? Savory. You choose. Mm -hmm. All right, so we have the Tesco brand bacon rashers. It sounds like a disease to me, but <laughs> okay, <laughs> like a pig rash or something. Because bacon is terrible. Like yeah. literally. Oh my god, the first time I smelled bacon was like literally three months ago in Paris, and it smelled so awful. And then I googled it, and it was like, <laughs> did you know that bacon smells like the flesh of human? Um, Humans just being burned. Mm, that is so lovely. That that was a great Holocaust. Mm, um, I'm salivating already. <laughs> but throwback. Kind Surprisingly, of this is vegan. Oh my god, it smells awful. This is what it looks like on the inside. It smells terrible. Smell it. Wow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, that's so bacony. Oh, oh my god. god. I, I never liked bacon. It like looks ever. like bacon too. Dudes, look at it. It's fucking scary. I don't know how I'm gonna. Blah, 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 blah. Well. All right, That's the ready? entertainment value <laughs> when we true. hate shit. It's true. All yes. right, cheers, babe. Cheers. No, ah, it's so bacon. Not really. Mm, yum, yum. It smells more bacony than it actually is. It's more like salty corn. No, it's definitely MSG in this. Let me have a look. Flavoring. Flavoring is M MSG, right? Yep. I could get used to this though. It's oh, just a salty oh. Thing. Mm. it reminds me of carefully. It's like an Israeli snack that you didn't bring me. I wanted to, but mm. they didn't have it. No, I'm not gonna have another one. Am I? Yeah. Mm. Mm. Am I? Mm. Am I? Mm. Am I? No, no. It gets better the more you eat yeah. it. It's alright. Mm. Like, I don't think I could buy it on the daily. But I just can't. That it looks like bacon. I can't. It really the smell, it's like the smell is super strong. What now? Chocolate thing. Really? To just like wash our mouth a little bit. Right. This is Tesco brand again because we're super basic bitches. It's supposed to remind you of After 8. That used to be one of my favorite chocolates. Oh my god, I need water off this shit. This is, you see? This is what we're talking about when we say we have problems with hydration. Oh my god, it smells like mint. Why? It's, it's like so chocolate with like a mint fondant. Okay, I opened it too much. Alright, this is what it looks like after I butchered the package. I think I need like a <laughs> a little bucket here on this. It's not gonna be that bad. Alright, let's try it. Cheers, babe. Cheers. I hope. Mmm. What is this? Oh, it's terrible. Oh my god. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's sweet, no. oh, it's terrible. Mm. It's not as good as... <laughs> Oh my god, it's terrible. Mm, that's gross. <laughs> it's, it's not as good as the proper after cool. eight, but it's not too bad. So oh my I don't god. Know about you. I like mint, but not with chocolate. Mint chocolate is life. <laughs> no. Oops. We need water. <laughs> oh, I wanted to finish this, but now it's all gross. You can have now. mine, it's full of saliva. Alright, <laughs> let's go for that. Uh, <laughs> I need something else. Let's do the chip. So this is a kettle chips. Still don't understand the principle of a kettle chip. Like what do you boil it? How is it a chip? And it's with sea salt and balsamic vinegar. Absolutely nothing artificial. Ah. It's, it's good. Good crisps. They're huge though. Yeah, they are. That's what she said. <laughs> Can we make a video without making any sex jokes? No. For one. Mmm. Wait, what is this? What? what? Something sour. And vinegar? This is strange. Uh, sour vinegar. Yeah. Mmm. Oh, look. This with beer. Mm, yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Yeah, we should probably save it. This yeah. was the most expensive thing here. Yeah, they tend to Two be pounds. pretty expensive. We think this is gonna be nasty. This is not a thing I've never tried before. But I know it's very popular and it's very Christmassy, so. Twiglets. Is it corn or whole grain? <laughs> what grain? 
you just Some know it's sort of like sticks covered in marmite i've actually never tried marmite before i'm waiting really oh my have god you? yes i have it was terrible Wait, where in uh, thailand marmite or vegemite vegemite it different it's the same freaking shit it just smells toasted yeah it, it looks like, like bagel sticks. like pretzels Oh, we're gonna it's die. A we're gonna die. Alright, cheers. You're right. <laughs> That's weird. It just mm. tastes burnt. Mm. Like it's just something that has been. <laughs> mm. This is, that is the most lovely play I've ever seen. <laughs> <coughs> no, 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 I forgot that Vegemite, it basically tasted like roasted salt and like burnt in hell or something. Bad, bad, so gross, I can't. It's so weird. It's not as gross as I thought it would be. I wouldn't eat it, but you know, not enough for me to spit it out. Sorry. B12. Yeast in that shit. Oh, disgusting. Fuck, I hate Vegemite, Marmite, all this shit, so gross. Ugh. Could have been worse. Maybe it could have been worse, but uh, I'm just not gonna buy it again ever. Now we have hopefully something tasty. Hopefully, it reminds me of like um, the smiley cookies we have in Israel, chiyuchim, because <laughs> right. it has the little holes on it, but it says bourbon on it. I mean, anything that says bourbon should probably be good. It's not alcoholic though. Oh, it's an, it's I'm, not. I'm sorry. No, right. this is a very British thing. This is the bourbon cream biscuits. Tesco in this color. Don't know if they have any other colors, but this vegan. This this vegan. This this is vegan. Vegan. Oh, it smells so good. It smells like chiyuchim. Right. Uh, this is what you. See. It looks like this, and there's like supposed to be a cream inside. Eee! Cheese, babe. Cheese. Beep. Mm. I love it. I love it. It's so good. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Okay. It's exactly like Chiyuchim. It's the same shit. Oh my god. Yeah. Another thing you didn't bring mm. me. I Itch. wanted to. If I brought you everything, what would you have left to eat in Israel? When you come to Israel. When I come to Israel. When I graduate from freaking university, mm. finally, I'll come to Israel as like my graduation trip. Finally, something good and shit. No, this was good too. You even like this. So. Yeah, but I don't see myself doing it again unless I'm already in the role. Well, unless you have a beer. I'll do this with a beer. Well. I have a lot of things to do with beer, so we have to drink more beer. I think that's a given. Oh. <laughs> mm. <laughs> we have the Tesco vegan chocolate. Um, this one is white chocolate. This one is choc and crispy. Blah, blah, blah. Chocolate. Blah. Cannot English after sugar. Choc and crispy bar. It's like the free from section. It doesn't actually say vegan, but it is vegan. Okay. This is what the choc and something something looks like. Yes. Technically, you if go. you touch the camera, it's gonna work. Cheers. Tesco. Chocolate. Mm. It's fine. I would eat it if I didn't have any other chocolate. Mm -hmm. No, wait. It's not that bad. No, this is pretty good. I mean, it's white chocolate. It's like super sugary oh, and that's one. it. White chocolate is always a problem. Mm. Mm. No, I don't like it. Wait, it's growing on me. Hey, hold on. This is not actually that bad. This one, if I'm stuck and I'm poor, <laughs> I'll get it. Much better than this crappy. I actually blow. did enjoy that. Good. Probably you have a whole that. package to eat. This was the last, last uh, drop. Now we no. actually have to leave the room. No. no the problem is, it, it's a Sunday. Like everyone's in the house. There's no way to avoid people. I know. Oh, I can't wait until we have money and we have our own house. I know. Oh my God. Mm. Dude, we're gonna have the best house ever. I think we should 
finish conclude this. Conclude this thing. Conclude. I conclude. think the biggest conclusion is that you can find vegan food everywhere, even accidentally vegan food. And Tesco is amazing. And this is not sponsored, in case you were wondering. No. I mean, we're, we're, still, just... we're still striving for that sponsorship. Hopefully. Like, I, I think we mentioned Tesco <laughs> in every single video. I think we do. With heart ties. Yes. So yeah, so far, I think we can say this was a great success. And the bourbon cream was a great success. Mm -hmm. the, the, the this was also pretty good, but other than that, I wouldn't buy it again. <laughs> yeah. Same, actually. I actually did like this one. Yeah. So maybe because I didn't have like mint things in so long, and I love them. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks so much for watching this. I hope you enjoyed it, and you learned that you can find vegan food everywhere. If you have any other snacks that you like at Tesco or any other place, definitely leave a comment down below, letting us know what's your favorite snack. If you like this video, make sure you thumb it up, comment on it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Go to Gaia's Instagram and spam it. Tell her she needs a channel because she still doesn't have one. Follow me on Snapchat and on Instagram. And I forgot to mention my ebooks, my Patreon, and my t-shirt shop. And that is it. Thanks for joining us. Oh, thank you. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Love you. Bye.